Welcome to Building Resilience for Children in After School Programs. In this video, we'll be learning all about resiliency and what it looks like within an after school program. Resiliency is the capacity to bounce back from difficult and even catastrophic situations. This could be the first day of any recreation program, because we all know that's never easy, or it could be an argument with a friend. Perhaps a child or youth is being bullied or doesn't like to participate because they're afraid to fail. Whatever the case may be, it's important that we learn what resiliency is, how to understand it for ourselves, and how to incorporate it into our after-school programs. Each day has its challenges, but it's how an individual overcomes these that makes all the difference. Why should you encourage and support resiliency? Children and youth who are resilient are better equipped for success in school, in relationships, and in life. They live happier and healthier lives. Of course, not all children and youth will naturally have the tools and skills to be resilient, so that's where we can step in as after-school leaders. What does resiliency look like? Resiliency is all about a positive self-concept and self-esteem. A child or a youth that's confident in themselves and their abilities to manage emotions has the right stuff to face any obstacles. The skills to problem solve as well as understanding how to ask for help will keep them on a positive path. Now on to the fun part. How can we help build resiliency in our participants through our programs? Aside from the obvious of being the really awesome, caring leaders that we are, here are some techniques that you can use to build resiliency into your after-school programs. Be a role model. Remember when you were a kid and looked up to those who were older than you? A sibling, a parent, a superhero? The participants in your program will look to you for pointers on how they can be great, too. So put on your superhero cape and start showing the kids how you are a positive thinker love to learn and are not afraid to admit that you don't know everything. Encourage, encourage, encourage. Participants need your encouragement and positive reinforcement. Don't be afraid to compliment each and every child on the things they've done well. And even if they do fail, praise them for trying. It's okay to fail. It's even better for them to keep trying. Give them the opportunity to succeed. While you want to challenge them, if you set the expectations too high, participants could get a little overwhelmed and turn into little bumps on a log that don't want to participate anymore. Nobody wants that, so make sure you give them a chance to succeed. Lastly, affirmation circles can do wonders. Peer pressure is bad, but peer affirmations can turn these participants into resiliency machines. Before you know it, compliments and encouragement will come naturally to each and every one of them, making their resiliency levels shoot through the roof. Now that you know what to do, go out there and do it. Start building resiliency, and you'll have yourself a team of awesome participants that are ready to take on the world. Thanks for checking out this session, and good luck with your programs.